the girl down my name is Victoria. For those who do know, welcome back to my channel. So, if you can't tell by the beginning, if you can't tell by the title, we are doing a curly hair routine slash review. I don't know. I'm gonna be trying this new combo out. I've never tried these products together, but I tried these products individually. The first one is the Mayo. First of all, let's get some backstory about my hair. So first of all, I did not know that I had curls until like the sixth grade. When my mom would do my hair, she would brush the hair out and just put it into a big puff on top of my head. But I never knew I had curls until the sixth grade when I started doing my own hair. Actually, not even in sixth grade, since I was 13. I was like in the eighth grade. Now I, I know that I got curls. So I've been in the curly, what's it called? Curly gang, curly, I don't know, curly girls, whatever. I've been in it for like two years. So this is not a tutorial. This is just my curly hair routine. Let's get started with the video. The product that we'll be using is Mayel Coil Sculpting Custard. This is what it looks like. I'm gonna be using this. I've used this product already, but not with the leave-in conditioner, leave conditioner that I'm using with it now. I always use this product with this one. This is the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen and Restore Leave-in Conditioner. I always use it with this. And it works pretty well for me, but I don't know, today I wanted to try a new combo. So I'm going to use this sculpting custard with this leave-in conditioner. So I used the leave-in conditioner, I used the leave-in conditioner yesterday to wash my hair. I'm doing this hairstyle on freshly washed hair so it can come out right. I've used this for my leave-in conditioner yesterday when I washed my hair but I've never used it with this and hopefully they go together they're from the same line so they should go together you don't want no flakes yeah so let me take this bonnet off I know so like I said I washed my hair yesterday and it's still wet So I got all these products, my water bottle, you heard that? Anyway, my gel for my edges, I need, um, what's this, I forgot, edge control, I don't have that, I use all mine, my Demon brush, to be honest, I don't know how to use this, so I don't even know how I'm going to use this, I have some clips, my toothbrush slash edge brush, I'm not gonna show you because it looks raggedy. And then I have a scrunchie. And of course, the two products I'm gonna be using. Hopefully this combo comes out right because, I mean, I don't have anywhere to go, but I wanna, hopefully it looks right because I did pay for it. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna split my hair. Well, it's already in two, so I'm gonna put my hair in two sections and put this side up. Then I'm going to split this section into another two sections. I'm going to be doing four sections. And then within each section, I'm going to section that section. If you don't understand, you'll see what I'm talking about. And I'm going to be using my mirror right here. Oh, y'all can see my little bite. Anyway, yes, this is the first section. And I'm going to wet it, even though it's already wet, but I'm going to just wet it again. Ooh. 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 Okay. I'm going to wet it. Why am I 
get the tingling. Even though it's pretty detangled from yesterday. Uh, so y'all, yesterday I did a avocado. And um, avocado, what's it called? Out the shower, it looked so good. If y'all want to see how I did that mask, comment down below and I'll gladly do it for y'all. So now I'm gonna go in with the leave in conditioner, even though there's a really leave conditioner in my hair, I'm just gonna put a little bit this much. This is how my hair is looking with the leave in conditioner. Now I'm going to split my hair into halves, another half, and put this up. And I'm going to go back in with some water. Okay, now that the leave-in conditioner is in, I'm going to go in with this, this coil sculpting custard. And I can't even open it because my hands are slippery. You know what? I'm going to use my pants. This is what it looks like. Murray jelly. Ooh. It feels like kind of bloody. Bloody. This bloody. No, it feels like slime. That's what it feels like. But I'm gonna just take a little bit because a little goes a long way with this. is looking to be honest I don't know how I feel about it but hopefully the result comes out looking good and now I'm gonna put this behind my back on my back and get the next section I put some more leave conditioner
put the two seconds together and I just go in with the custard again. Move on to the next section. Okay, now I'm gonna do the same thing that I did with the, that last section. Going to spray water on it. into the half and put this side up Yeah, my neck hurts. And I already, I gotta do this side too. <gasps> now I'm gonna come back with this side done. Okay, y'all, I'm done with this first section. And this is how it's looking. Curls are defined. And now I'm just going to move on. To the section and when I'll come back when this section is done. to get my head brush, my toothbrush. I 
Okay, I just put these clips in to push my hair back. But y'all, check out my hang time. Check out my hang time. Anyway, bye. Hey, y'all. It is now the next day, and this is how my hair turned out. It's all dried. And I like it. I put it in the sides part because that's the normal part that I usually do. Yeah, this is what the back looks like. Now, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos like this. Also, if you have any recommendations on videos you would like me to see me do, put them down in the comments and I will gladly do them. If you made it this far to the video, comment down below your favorite season. My favorite season is fall because that is my birthday month. I am a fall baby. And I'll see you guys next week. Deuces! Okay, bye.